before. It's not nothing to do with the mic, just the um, earpieces. It's, and I was worried it was starting to do it there again. I hope it's not on the way out. I've been using it a lot over the past year of having it. So I may need to get a new one. Master Horace Wand knows immediately. Here, take this package of corpse wheat down the road to the camp at Raven Hill. Tell him what we saw at the Jorgenstead. Eh? What I saw. Damn it. Fucking lag. Fleet footed. Your movement speed is increased by 15% and you take reduced falling damage. Nice. Sprint's cooldown is reduced by a minute. Main Gauche. Your main end attacks have a 17.6 chance to trigger an attack with your offhand that deals 107 physical damage. Keep in mind that's based on my current stats, so it's a little different. Uh, you can bribe a non-player humanoid target up to level 55 uh, with Fool's Gold, convincing it to fight for you for 5 seconds. That might scale with my level. Either that or that's an ability that's only basically relevant for the first two levels of having it. Well, maybe the first few levels of having it, but it'll quickly get worthless. Which, considering how much trimming and priming they've done, be a little weird. As a side point, I'm not sure if they're still here, but if you enter into this building... What the fuck? What in the seven hells? Um, They weren't meant to be there. Well, okay. Well, obviously they are meant to be there, but they are not the ones I was going for. There's beasties here called the Unknown. The Unknown, or maybe they're not the Unknown, but they were... They're ghosts that you can't see. Uh, with, um, unless like, you detect invisible, or you do an AoE, then you get attacked by level 50. And then when you're here, that'll be fatal. But it's a Veiled... Fanatic. Veiled Fanatic. They apparently could be found in Stormwind City, as well as the Blasterlands. And the w ones in, Spud in Stormwind City can... They're tied in with... Um, no, Egypt. I have no idea what these are about. They're part of the Veiled Hand. They're a human sect who served the Burning Legion. The cult was formed during the Legion's third invasion. The, its leaders, uh, its members are the ruling council. What the fuck? Its members are the ruling council of the Darkshire Town and its guards, the Night Watch. And Commander Attila Ebenlock is on it. And they want to bring down Stormwind. There's a Lord Elo Ebenlock as well. There's a... And it seems all of 
uh, the Night Watch NPCs are in uh, the cult. And a fair amount of the town is dead because of them. Uh, let me count. There's apparently victims of the cult. Uh, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, fifteen. There's fifteen dead because of the cult. Um, apparently, uh, the Watcher Lattimore had been a member of the Veiled Hand during the invasion. Uh, sorry, during the beta, but it was changed due to player objections. Um, which, yeah, I kind of like that. Uh, so it seems not all of the uh, of the um, uh, Night Watch is part of it, but seems most of the members are. Since I don't know the ex the names of each Night Watch person, it just seemed like the entire list, that, due to the amount of members they had, it seemed like the, to be the entirety of the Watch. But yeah, they're all in a cult, and this is part of it. Uh, I have no idea where this ties in, when you go and deal with these or anything. Um, maybe if I pry a bit deeper, they're probably due to some class quest. Christ, the guy in charge of the uh, guy by the hero's call board, Malris Maligan is Herald of the Legion. He's part of the Veiled Hand. Yeah, a rogue goes is one of the people who stops him. The Unseen Blade. So I guess Kolgorath will have a bit of shanking to do later, won't he? Wonder why they want to usher in the Ouija. How are you? Christ. Um well, they want to take down Stormwind and they're associated with the Legion. Yeah. Yeah, for sorry, for a moment there I, I thought I misremembered. Uh no no, never mind. Um M Master Harris requires many reagents for serums. He has me gathered in form. Most of it's not so bad. I I mean, the corpse weed is pretty bad, but it's not as bad as the widow venom. Have you seen the widows around here? The hatchings are the size of a man. Even with a gun, I can't stand to go out hunting them. It's just too ter uh, terrifying. Uh, if you do, go, uh, if you go do it for me, I'll gladly pay you. Just bring me back some widow venom. You'll find them all in the, in the woods to the east, just north of the road. But yeah, I was just gonna go into the into the inn and show you, like, oh, here's the um these guys. Uh, like he, the, there's the unknown or whatever they're called in here. I can't show them to you because I have no AOE. But then I just get fucking shanked in the face by them. And they are Legion enemies. The rest, there's other areas where they appear. Like they appear in Stormwind, uh, Blastlands, um, maybe one other place. I swear it seemed like there's four. But, um,. Um, what am I thinking? Um, sorry, let me start that again. I just wanted to go in and show you whatever beat those beasties was, but I just end up stumbling into that mess instead. Whoa! Christ, you run fast! I just wanted to peek in the corner. But yeah, there are straight out Legion enemies. Uh, the ones in the rest of the a those areas are apparently phased. But these ones in Duskwood aren't. So, yeah. I, I can't remember where I was going with that other point. Basically, I was just going to be like, here's these beasties, but I ended up stumbling into that mess instead. I think that's all I was going to say. I'm not entirely sure right now. Yes. I'm just tired of dying, damn it. The dead. Um, inner fire. Uh. The dead cry for, sol for solace. Their anguish echoes on the winds. This is a tragic land with a history of violence and despair. 
while many of the dead roam in the flesh, some are simply lost souls wandering in conf confusion that deserve to be put at ease. Many of these souls gather at the Adelstead to the south, appearing before travellers. They this censer of holy incense, sway before the fallen spirits, and let the, and let the offering with gentle scent give them peace. Rebels without a clue. Several years ago, Stormwind's Captain uh, Curzon brought a brigade into the Stranglethorn Vale on a mission whose details are still murky. Curzon swiftly descended into Manus, as did his men, except for a few rebels who made it their mission uh, to undo the evils that Curzon had wrought. As I said, that was years ago. I'm now hearing rumors that Curzon is dead, but the, those rebels still persist at their rebellion. If you wish to investigate, you'll find them at the camp on Stranglethorn's northern border. Let the light of the we'll gather that later. Over Harris. I think we saw this guy before. Actually, no. I t maybe we did. I then again, I swear it's been so long. He. D I think this might be a different guy. Uh, but I can't remember for sure. Uh, what brings you out this way, my good sir? Welcome to our humble camp. I won't call it pleasant, but at least it's somewhat private. Except for those incredibly powerful cults that's in there. And... You know. All the zombies over there. And the random... And the bear over there. Beg your pardon? A worgen at the farm? What we do here is not a cure. The transformation cannot be removed once inflicted. But the mind. The mind can be restored to alchemy, if enough is left intact. This worgen you've encountered sounds like he's fighting to stay aware, Kolgorod. We've got to find him again. He's fled to the uh, Jorgen stead, search the adult set to the south, maybe lurking in one of the buildings. Inject him with his ampule to tranquilize him. We need to be quite close. Use Harris's ampule to tranquilize him. We get this five point from uh, John Shelby. I swear I saw him somewhere else. I wonder if the unknown are still in there, or they've probably been removed to be replaced by the other ones. But I wouldn't know for certain. I can't detect the visible, so yeah. The jitters bugs. Okay, I'll deal with the spirits in a minute. I'll go uh, get the uh, deal with the spiders first. Do you wonder? Blizz, isn't BlizzCon coming up soon? I wonder if they're going to announce the new uh, expansion at it. Considering that um, Legion is kind of done, you know? Well, not done. I, d I do believe Argus is the last patch. And the raid has come out, I do believe. Um, I also do believe... And, like, the, dun the Argus dungeon and the Argus raid are out. And... All that. Um, I do believe, like, all the content that was going to be added in is done. Maybe I'm wrong. But, um... Yeah, I want, I'm, I'm just wondering when the new expansion is coming out. Because I'll have to be keeping up to date on that. And if it's coming out too soon, which I doubt it would be, it's probably a fair bit off. Um, I would have to start upping the amount of Ouija videos you get. Hopefully not too much. Wouldn't want to have to put up 12 a day for a bit. That would be a bit much. In some cases, I'm already putting up 12 a day anyway. But 12 of Ouija would be a bit overkill. At least in my, in those other cases, it was it was you know a few different things. Twelve of a single show would be a little overkill. But yeah, uh, just on the cult thing, I can see why people would have issue with that. Just the story of um, you know Morgan. It's it's kind of a a, ni a nicer take that his daughter follows in his footsteps. The non grief stricken version you know that you know she's like you know like her dad you know you know a good honorable person and just wants to help people rather than being a demon worshipping scum fuck so yeah that's the uh, technical term Also, I just realized a way to help level up my mining. 
That will be a bit quicker than just running around mining. Let's find it. Uh, well, let's go here. Smitting! You know, if I go, go and let's go smelt a bit of shit, that'll work. Also, I probably should have aggroed that spider there. Strange they didn't. Just figured I'd rode close enough to do so. Also, I am surprised that I've actually managed to get all the herbs th this quickly. I figured I wouldn't. But, there you go. Alright. Hmm. Strange I haven't discovered here. Okay. Let's head back over to Jitters and turn this in. Maybe he'll have something else for us. Then we can swing down, deal with the ogres, then deal with the farmstead. Once we're done, damn, we're actually quite near done. There's a bit to do with Raven Hill. A, 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 ch a long chain, and by long, I mean there's like five, six parts to it, if that. And then the uh, Moral Adam quest. As a side point, there used to be a quest in Wa a chain in WoW that was like 30 parts long. It, it was like 20 something for WoW. Uh, or maybe it wasn't 30. Maybe it was like 27. For Hordes 23 for Alliance or something. Uh, Hordes got a few extra quests to it. But, um. Yeah, um. I can't remember, but it was that Blasted Lands quest I was mentioning in the past. Hello. Just checking. Recording locally, 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 locally. Line across, line up, line left, right, up. Okay, that seems fine. And. The mic is down. Good. Sorry, I just have to make sure. Did you get it? Please tell me you got it. Oh, thank you, thank you. You saved me from having to go out into wo in the woods with those awful things. For a day, uh, for a at least for a day, that is. I'm afraid that, well, I'm just plain afraid, but I'm also, uh, but I'm also sorry to, to, um, to have to ask for another favor. Master Harris needs brains. Bare brains. They're a part of the serum, apparently, or at least a proper substitute. There are plenty of black berries in the woods to the west along and along the riverbank, but I can't do it. I'm too terrified to go out and, and face those huge things, even with a rifle. Please, let me pay you to bring back some. See you later. To be honest, I'm not really surprised considering what's here that he's of a nervous disposition. Fucking lag. It lagged so long that it was behind me, so I couldn't do the ability. Heavier than you would think. You can see a different design bridge over here. And we've seen this back in like Terraceville. Um Which is kinda of fitting to see it here, considering, you know? It's all dark and grim. Kinda of like Terraceville. So it's kinda of fitting to see such a designed bridge here. Rather than, you know, this nice stone one up north. There is actually a quest I was meaning to do over in Westfall, but I'll do that at a later stage. I can't be bothered doing it right now. It's a minor side quest. <laughs> I love the bear's response. Oh no, I got stabbed. Better sleep. <laughs> Ruined bear skull. This was a bear of ver a very little brain. Say that's a reference. Right. Uh, but uh, all I keep thinking of is Yogi Bear, Str uh, you know, uh, smarter than the average bear. But not the right phrasing for it to be a reference to that. Oof, nice. Come on. What do you like? The internet's been terrible as of late. Like, seriously. It's too far away. Just wanted to cooperate good enough while I'm trying to record here, damn it. And when I'm trying to upload. Actually, when I was using my phone uh, stuff earlier, the uh, internet was so good, 
Alright, I got mine up over like 50 something episodes.